It is a persevering journey that teaches you a lot about your destination. And reminiscing back, you realize you wish you could go there again. Because it is all the experience that is the reason that you are who you are today. A very good evening to everyone gathered here today. I am Meera Taneja. I am Aryan Tehan. I am Avni Chopra. And I am Michelle Philip. And we are your hosts for this evening. We warmly welcome you all to the Deck 10 culmination celebration of Kinskatko. We would like to welcome our esteemed guests. We have with us Mr. Kunal Bhatu, who is the co-founder and member of board of Kunskap Skolan Adventures India. Dr. Prashant Bhalla is a promoter and board member of Kunskap Skolan India Schools. He is also the president of Manav Rachna Educational Institute. Promoter and board member of Kunskap School in India. He is also the uh, he is also the vice president of Manav Rachna Educational Institution. Mr. Kale Emerson, the chairman of Kunskap School in India. Mr. Anders Bauer, the CEO of Ketpec Sweden. Ms. Sunita Nambiar. CEO of Kunskap School in Edu Ventures. Ms. Sabrina Talwar, the Education Director of Kunskap School in Gurgaon. Let us begin our celebration with a folk music presentation. This is a musical performance based on the folk styles of Assam, Maharashtra, Rajasthan and Rajasthan to celebrate the arrival of different seasons. Each season brings with it hopes and aspirations, an opportunity to broaden one's horizons and transform oneself to develop a new mindset and to grow. On this note, we would like to invite the students to present their performance on the stage.
are equal but different and you learn in different ways and the idea to put 30 or 40 kids in one classroom for 45 minutes you know that you will lose a number of them so with modern technology you can make the education experience much more personalized and that's what I'm seeing the drive in India a school is a place where I control my learning. I, I choose my learning. For the child to feel that, okay, here is a place that someone actually cares about what I want to learn. On the first day at Kunskab School in Guma, I remember walking in and wondering if we could bring alive the vision of giving our students a voice and a choice. That question lasted for a couple of months, but no more, because I saw the way our students flourished. It's been 10 years now, 10 years of keeping the student at the center of all we do, 10 years of creating a personalized learning environment where children achieve their goal, of creating a community of teachers who are passionate and care. That for me is the legacy of Kunskab School in Gurgaon. And I am so proud to be a member of this team. I look forward to many more years of Kunskab School growing and giving students the knowledge, the skill and the heart to be contributors of the society that they live. I didn't actually like going to school at first. I used to cry because um, 
I used to be nervous. I used to wish a lot. I still remember in the first year, no assistant teachers, nothing, and we had Sunita Ma'am, and we had Mats and Mark Parkinson, admin head, all these people uh, holding on to pre-nursery babies and doing babysitting when the kids would cry in the morning. My first teacher was Nikita. She really helped me in academics and sports. These ten years have been very beautiful with Kul Scrap School. We've seen Ariman grow into a confident child. He's happy to go to school. He's become very responsible. Ten years is short in comparison to the lifetime of an institution or an organization. In these ten years, Kunskap School and Program has built a name for itself to contend with. There were moments of joy, tears, despair, and unprecedented challenges. Yet one thing prevailed was our unwavering belief in what we do. Kulskap Skolden was a big part of my life. Um, I did most of my schooling from there, and I also passed off from there as the first batch, even. So. Um, Whatever I'm do, I'm doing today, and who I am today was was shaped by Kunskap Skolan, and in the best way possible. I learned a lot of uh, core skills there, and I made a lot of friends there. And the way you should approach life was taught really well in school, and I am always grateful for the way Kunskap Skolan gave me a platform to actually. Be able to reach my potential and actually learn and grow. Kunskap Skolan is not only for academics; it is for all over development of one's personality. Each and every subject was given equal attention. Today, what I am, where I am, and what I'll be all credited goes to one and only Kunskap Skolan, the knowledge school. As our school, Kunskap School in Gurgaon, celebrates its 10-year anniversary, I can't help but reflect on how much we have grown and accomplished together. Looking back at my years here, I'm struck by the incredible opportunities we as students have had to explore our passions, develop new skills, and make lasting friendships. I am honored to have served as the deputy head of our school council in 2021. and i know the cat values of leadership and service that i've learned here will stay with me for years to come hi marcus here congratulations for the 10th year anniversary and what a growth and what a journey you on and uh i'm happy to be in a part of it and uh still to be a colleague in the kid network all the best take care as an academic head i experienced a school with a lot of commitment and a great go ahead spirit i also saw brilliant work with the personal education and the willingness to use the kid tools such as personal coaching learning portal and much more KKG is an important Kunskap school in India but all, and also in the whole CAD network. I would really like to congratulate you on this 10 first successful years. Hi, this is Niklas Dahlström speaking from a lovely spring morning in Varberg, Sweden. When I started KKG in 2019, I was a little bit anxious about how to behave, how to act and how to react on things that pop up when you come to a new country and a new job. So I asked Sabrina how to behave and she said with a broad smile just go with the flow Nicholas. So I did and I experienced one of my most exciting years of my life. So to all of you at KKJ and in the audience thank you for a wonderful year. Happy 10 years and make the next 10 years even better. Take care, keep up the good work and don't forget to go with the flow. You are celebrating 10 fantastic years and you are truly a diamond in the Kunskap school and family. And the success story of Kunskap school is that we in fact learn from each other from each one of the countries where we have our schools. I really wish the best for you in the future. For the next coming 100 years of Kunskap school in India, 
and let this fantastic journey and success story keep on going. My heartfelt gratitude from me, Kenneth Newman, to all of you in Kroska School and in India. Being an educator, I think you evolve every day and you learn every day. So from not having ever taught to where I am today, I give the entire credit to Kunskap School. I love my school, Kunskap School. Kunskap School and Gurgaon, we have a good time. One job, Komu Sawa, Jema Pela Araya. I love my school. Hi, Bhuvan. Mama, I'm going to call you a little bit. I'm going to call you a song. I'm going to sing a song for you. I'm going to sing a song for you. I'm going to sing a song for you. I'm happy 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 to sing a song for you. सकाल वाला जो कॉफी चाय कॉफी बनाई तो सारा दिन किसान किसान का खुश हो जाए। proud to be part of this thriving Kunskap School in community. As we move ahead, we will continue to foster an environment of curiosity and build an ambience of collaboration and empathy. As a lifelong learner, I look forward to the learning opportunities lying ahead for me to grow and learn here as a head of school. It will be my endeavor to ensure that Kunskap School continues to be a happy learning space for our students and a wonderful working space for our team members. Here's looking forward to many more successful years ahead for Kunskap School in Kurka. What a beautiful journey it has been. It is our privilege and honor to have with us Mr. Kunal Bhadu. The inception of Kunskap Skolan in India clearly reflects Mr. Bhadu's vision of a personalized education to prepare individuals for the dynamic world. We would like to invite you, sir, to share your thoughts with us. distinguished uh, staff members, members of the board. The year was 2012-13 and uh, I tell people this uh, story, I said uh, that year I had twins. Twins, someone said, they said, but I 
know that you've just got one son, so how is it twins? So I said the other one was Kunskap School in Gurgaon. It was my baby that in 2012 saw the light of the day. We've all nurtured it like our own child. <clears throat> in the videos that you saw, how from uh, Sunita, seeing Sunita and the team, Sabrina and everyone literally sort of you know handhold and have like those children in their arms to uh, where we stand today you know 220 staff members 1700 students I'll just take you to the journey back where it all started and uh, this is the time that uh, I was living in London I had quite an unusual journey born into a family of uh, agriculturists had the privilege of going through different school systems I spent four years in a convent I spent about nearly five or six years in a public school at Mayo College I spent two years in a school which was known for its academic rigor Delhi Public School, R.K. Pura I happened to have the privilege of working in a world-class organization in London. I worked with PwC in London for about six, seven years. And this was just one fine day that I was reflecting back. I was preparing a training course for new recruits into PwC. And I just got thinking. I said that tomorrow, when I'm going to have a son or a daughter, the education system that I'd like to see them go through to prepare them to successfully take on challenges that I am taking on today. How can I combine the best of everything that I have seen in my own journey? There were good things in all the education systems that I saw. How can I future-proof my child or the future generations in such a sporadically fast-changing world and that's the quest that led me to Kunskap Skolan. And I'm proud that through Kunskap Skolan and Mr. Prashant Bhalla, Mr. Amit Bhalla, his family, we were able to give India its first school offering personalized education. Today, we have nearly 3,000 students, 3,000 families that have put in our trust across India in Bangalore, in Lucknow, in Gurgaon, and even in a remote place in Punjab called Abohar, which happens to be my hometown, where we have a CAD-inspired school following CAD values, the Delhi Public School Abohar. All this wouldn't have been possible without your assistance. It was my vision, it was my idea, but what has brought it to life is each one of you sitting here in front of me. And I thank you from the bottom of my heart for getting to Kunskap Skolan where it is. I would finally say, you know, just taking a leaf out of uh, what was there in, you know, on, uh, on the last slide of, of the slideshow of the video that just played, that 10 years and we've just got started. I envisioned this school as not a school that was just to offer personalized education or future-proof your child. When I said, when I began, I said, you know, I had twins in 2012. While every father aspires that his child grows up to be the most successful human being on the planet, similarly, I aspire that Kunskap School in Gurgaon happens to be the best school in the world and let's work towards it. Thank you. Thank you, sir, for your inspiring words. Jeevan ke karn mein hai nritya, khushiyo ka srot hai nritya. Coming up is the time for us to enjoy an Indian dance performance. This is an invocation dance executed through the Bharat Natyam dance style. This dance piece celebrates the positive energy of Ganesha, who is believed to be the manifestation of the Supreme Entity.
Yesterday when it all started, and I remember this was the place where I think the first exhibition was held and, and I remember Kunal really leading the way and he was the one standing up here in that hall trying to really settle his vision and his idea and we all heard and him and uh, the passion that uh, is there in him in terms of when he brought this idea to us and we all uh, decided to collaborate as family, as friends and today we are here with the group really growing and uh, the numbers growing as well but more than that I think uh, the purpose uh, which uh, we all felt that we truly stood for and as Manav Rachna group led by our founder we have been in the field of education for the last 26 years now and uh, the pur larger purpose was to give back to the society through education and that's what we have been doing in the past and the motto has been to create better human beings Unscap Skolan, when it came, it was something unique uh, to this part of the world and uh, I think, uh, I feel that we have been able to uh, do justice to the thought that got curated then and today where it is. 
uh, it's a great teamwork and it's all about the kind of uh, collaboration that has happened in really building it up well. Whether it is the CED network, whether it is the Manav Vesva ecosystem, the energy and zeal of uh, Kunal and his uh, contribution per se in getting very deeply involved in the whole micromanagement of things and ensuring that when the whole process was getting initiated, uh, the whole purpose was rightly built. So as you say that the foundation has to be strong enough and that foundation was really laid out well and that's where uh, uh, we started and today uh, we are growing strength by strength. I congratulate uh, all of you who have been part of this journey and especially uh, the students uh, today for their great performance and it was really a feat to watch and I hope that uh, we will be celebrating many such uh, occasions together and the way this whole decade has gone, the next decade will even be far uh, better for us and uh, Kunal has given uh, a new target, a new vision. So let's uh, all dream uh, to achieve that and I hope uh, the way we all have uh, come in as family and have grown together, the same spirit will continue and we will see far uh, uh, more achievements in the future too. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Moving on, we have a Western music performance. It is a song which instills hope and compassion. It overwhelms everyone with happiness and the emotions one would feel once ultimately reaching his dreams. The song makes you envision your future and keeps you motivated to translate your dreams. As we celebrate their care, we remember our initial years of struggle when we commence this program and reach the pinnacle of our success by striving hard with passion, forbearance, and with concrete goals.
was a fantastic performance. We are delighted to have with us Mr. Kale Emilson. He has more than 10 years of experience in the education sector in Sweden, US, UK, Saudi Arabia and the Netherlands. Mr. Emilson's vision is to continue to expand Kunskap Skolen's operations in India. We would like to invite you sir to share your thoughts with us on this momentous occasion. Thank you so much. And uh, first of all, uh, thank you so much for these lovely performances and also the the uh, the film, uh, which was uh, very 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 nostalgic. Uh, I'm extremely pleased to be here to celebrate the 10 year anniversary of Princess Kulang Gang with all of you. Uh, it has actually been almost 25 years now uh, since my father started Kunskap School now. Uh, and already from the outset with a clear vision uh, to form a personalized education, concept for personalized education that fully respects that we as individuals all need to find find our individual ways to learn, uh, to fulfill our, our full potential. Uh, my family and I are immensely proud and also emotional. I am emotional to see this being realized, not only in Sweden, uh, but in this lovely country, in the Middle East and elsewhere uh, in the world. Uh, I would like to, like to take this opportunity to, uh, to express my family's great gratitude to uh, Kunal Badu and his family for, being, uh, for, for taking the initiative, having the vision 10 years back to see that that uh, this could be uh, implemented also in, in India. And for uh, Dr. Uh, Prashant Bala, Dr. Amit Bala and uh, their family for, uh, for also contributing in, in our uh, partnership uh, with so much knowledge about education in, in India and all the sort of infrastructure and competence to, to realize uh, the vision. Uh, we very much look forward to following uh, closely the, the next 10 years of Kunskapskolan Gurgaon and Kunskapskolan in India. Uh, we will see further expansion, I'm sure, uh, not only in number of students and, and sites, but also in uh, the number of boards and cur uh, curricula that, that uh, we are offering. Uh, as you know, we are taking the, the first IB step now for our organization, which uh, is very, very exciting. Uh, Lastly, I would like to, uh, to thank you all. Uh, I would like to thank uh, Sumita Nambier and the, the local management team for their hard and dedicated work. And uh, also, of course, to all you teachers and other staff uh, for day to day on the ground, uh, making sure that our vision is realized in practice. Many, many thanks to all of you. What could be more wonderful than children representing a diverse community's dance style? Jazz funk is inspired by African American roots. It is a celebratory dance which is which is mainly formed to which is mainly formed to commemorate a special occasion. Today, the students are going to present an enthusiastic dance form, which will certainly be unforgettable. It is a showcase of teamwork and collaboration, which will surely bring smiles to your faces.
lively and enthusiastic performance. We would like to invite Dr. Amit Bhalla to kindly say a few words. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Good evening. <laughs> what happened? Why are we not replying? Good evening. Good evening. So, I was seeing the presentation made by the entire team, which was talking about a particular date, 7th of April 2013. So, I was sitting and remembering 6th April the entire night. You know, I was there in the school. And I left the school early morning at 7.30 when everybody was walking into the school because there was a lot of work which was pending in the school and we were trying to finish it off and we were chasing time. And 10 years have passed and Sunita and uh, we are still doing that in our every project. Am I right? You know, in the last uh, 15 years we got an opportunity to start 12 schools. So we have to chase time every time. And you see that happening in Kunskap School and Gurgaon and it happens at across all Mana Vishnu institutions. We try to start new schools year on year basis. Covid gave us some breather to stop starting new schools and today when Kunal, Kale, Prashant, everybody was talking about expansion, our next decade will be bigger and brighter. I was again thinking of some more sleepless nights which would come to my perfect. So I would like to take this opportunity to first Thank each one of you who is present here and who is not present here, who has been part of our this fantastic journey of learning, of establishing and running new schools. It was a dream which Kunal shared and uh, we had a lot of agreements, disagreements, a lot of discussions on building what Kunscap School and is today. And would like to thank each one of you for making Kunscap School and what it is today. And in particular, the time when all of us were not very sure that what will happen when we were dealing with COVID. Each and every teacher and every support staff of the school, all of you were with the school team, with the school leadership, with parents, with students, and ensuring that learning is continuing. So compliments to each and every one of you. We never got an opportunity to say thank you, thank you in person for that. So that was the time when you were struggling at home, not sure whether, you know, how next morning will be for each one of you in your personal capacities, how the family will respond. Maybe some person in the family who is down with COVID, handling the, your kids at home, handling respective husbands and wives at home, because we are not used to living together for so many hours in a day continuously. <laughs> so that was a difficult time, but I'm sure that all of us sailed very well out of it and uh, we have worked very hard to build this institution and I assure you that you will find all support from all of us for building this the best institution what Kunal has just given the target to all of us. And I would also like to place on record the contribution of the North East Indian support staff, the guys who are there on the road managing traffic early morning and even at the time of dispersal, the way they handle the cars, the parents, the buses, the neighbors and each and every issue which takes place there and of course you know we saw Biswas he was serving us coffee today afternoon I asked for tea and he gave me coffee because he knows that he makes very good coffee <laughs> so I told him he said sir aapko achha lagta hai. I said okay fine whatever you say boss so it's a teamwork where all of us have worked together all parents all students and compliments to the entire performing arts team this was an outstanding performance and I could, you know, the best performance is when you see the person who is sitting on the front chair and he wants to dance. So, Anders was quite excited and he was clapping and he wanted to dance. And I was asking Kale, Kale, I think that we can't dance like this. And when I saw the kids who were there, you know, doing a somersault and they were just doing a split there, I thought, okay, it's better that we don't even try that. <laughs> so, compliments once again to each one of you and keep the spirit high. Just one thing what I would like to say with all of you is that, Please be with us. We will work together and we will grow together. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir, for sharing your thoughts with us. We would like to call upon the members of the Ked India family who have completed 10 years with us. 
Our institution has reached its pinnacle of success with the tireless efforts put in by each team member, working towards the same goal. Thank you for all the support we continue to receive in our journey. We would like to invite Mr. Kunal Badu to facilitate the members of the team.
read you our school song today, encompassing the idea of who we are. This song has been composed in collaboration between the students and the teachers. Thank you. 